All right, so. Um, there's just one more thing I gotta do before I end the video. I gotta find, there's a way to get on top of Gruntilda. Because you have to get, you have to get inside her hat. If you get inside her hat, there's a way, hold on, there's a way. Then you can get her little goodie. Um, there's a way. You know, you might have to fall into it. I think there is a way later on, but I want to see if there's a way to do it right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, there's a hole there you're supposed to fall in. When you fall from that hole, you fall in, you can grab that jiggy. But I want to see if I can get to it by just jumping, or jumping on top of her finger. Hold on. Maybe you can't, but, you know, it's worth a shot. No, I don't think you can. Yeah, I don't. I think it's too far. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna bother. I, I'll just get it later. All right. So I think we basically explored this area too. We have 400 notes, but we can open. All right, and uh, we're almost done here. I just wanna explore a little bit more and basically get to the Freeze Easy Peak area. So this is also kind of. Um, uh, previewing a future level. And we got another one of these dudes. This one's a little stronger. Takes an extra hit, but essentially is the same enemy. And we have a little switch here so we can unlock this. Oh, I think that's what I gotta do. Okay, I thought it was like much later in the game, but I guess it's right now. Which makes sense because we went upstairs, so uh, basically you just uh, you just have to do this. What I'm about to do right here, right now. There you go. And you just jump right in, and there you go. And you fall. And there you go. That's how you do it. Okay. Well, whatever. I thought you had to get it later, but I'll take it. I, I think we already got, I think it was five now that we have, out of ten, so we're like, you know, we're cruising along in this in this game. Now there are nine worlds, and we've completed four of them, so we're not quite halfway, but we're, we're getting there. We're getting there. And uh, I knew that this project was going to be a little bit lengthier, which is fine. It is what it is. Alright, now we need this for something, I don't remember what for though. I need more eggs! I need more eggs! Dear God, I need more eggs! Um... Okay, that's where I came from. And that was the door that took me to the switch, I think. And, uh, oh, I haven't gone there. Let's see, what's this? Oh, I know it's a mumbo token. Uh, I think this will open up, uh, later as well. This will take us... to the entrance of this world. Oh, snap. I forgot. You can't go in there. Oh, I think that's why you need the uh, the boots, so you can access the world. Um, but we're not ready to access the world, so we're not going to go that way yet. I think the only other way to go is this way. And uh, there's another note door over there, which, again, I'm not going to go to just yet. I'll kill this guy just, just for kicks and giggles. Uh, he didn't really seem like he wanted to fight back, though. I feel bad now. Just bullying this guy. Oh, there's another guy. Oh, he wants to start something. You want to start something? Huh? You want to start something? Want to mess with me? I don't think so, sir. No, sir. Alright. Um. So we're here. Ooh. Uh, dang, what is it that I have to do to get this? Oh, do I have to just fire an egg? Oh, yeah. 
Oh, just hit it with an egg. Sure. Alright, so we opened up a teleport and we have a match. I think this takes us basically to the beginning of the of Gruntilda's lair. Cool. Yeah, I could hop in and see, but I don't need to go over there, so sorry. Sorry to disappoint you, sir. I know you waited a long time for me to show up. Long enough for Cobb's webs to show up at the door. But uh it's just not happening, sir. I'm just not ready for you. You're just not relevant anymore. Maybe at one point you would have been relevant, but you're not relevant anymore. You side with Banjo, but change tack. Imagine you on Grunty's back. Damn, like, I didn't realize that Grunty, like, really badly wanted Kazooie to join her ranks. Okay, I could go in there, but... Uh, I don't think there's anything else to do. I thought that there was, like, a ramp. I, I could have sworn there was a ramp. Hold on. I guess not. I could have sworn like that there was a ramp up here that, that goes somewhere. Well, there's... Uh, I don't know. I mean... That's like... What do they call that? What do they call that theory? Um, the Mandela Effect? Or whatever? Oh, wait, there's a ramp. I knew there was a ramp. I thought I was going crazy. I'm sure a lot of you were starting to like question it too. Like, wait, I thought there was a ramp too. <laughs> it's not a Mandela effect. There actually is a ramp. I just couldn't freaking find it. All right, how do you do this? Uh, can I fire eggs at it? Oh, yeah, you can. Just open up portal. Match. I don't remember. I don't think so. I think this one's for takes you to a later part of the game. I'll just jump in just to find out. Yeah. yeah I, I need to get another cauldron that's going to show up later. Alright, this will get me to the top of Gruntilda's hat there. And another Bruntilda. The disgusting Gruntilda has tadpoles on toast for breakfast. Mmm. Wait, why am I saying that? That's cannibalism. That that bastard eating my eating my tadpole brethren. Okay. Then she usually has maggot pie for dinner. Yuck! I'm still here. I watch you play, but I can't think of much to say. Then don't talk, man. Shut the f shut the fuck up, man. Wart bags then finishes with cockroaches and cream for dessert. How horrid. Yeah, that's fucking gross. I'm I'm someone who does not like roaches whatsoever. I'll kill them if I have to, but if they fly, I'm running. I am running from the flyers, man. I can't get up there. It's even too it's even too steep for Kazooie. Even Kazooie's talent trot cannot handle the slope of that hat. Ain't nobody handling the slope of that hat. Not even from this angle? No, I guess not. Okay. Well, that was pretty much pointless. But, hey. You know, at least... Uh... At least I know I'm not crazy with that ramp from back there. Alright, and this is basically going to take us to the entrance. And before I go in... Well, I'm not going to be going in. I'm going to end the video very soon. But uh, I want to just kind of explore a little bit. Still a few more things to do here. Specifically, we're going to go through here. And there's actually another little pathway over here. I don't, I don't think you could use these until you found out how... Oh. Uh, there's like a pad... I don't, I don't want to bother with that right now. What is it? What is it even anyway? Okay. Well, you know what? I think I do want to try doing it. Yeah, I'll do it. Cause otherwise it's gonna drive me crazy. Like, what? What? What was it? What's What's going on there? That's okay, I don't mind if uh, I record a little bit longer. 
Although I, I, I may edit, you know, something out if uh, I feel like it's uh, just kind of dragging on. Okay, so basically what I'm going to do is... Oh, wait, I can't do it yet because I need the shoes probably. But at the very least, let me open this up because I'm going to need to anyway. So I need to use... I basically need to hit the switch or grab the shoes, hit the switch, then run over, and then fly. And then I guess you can do something when you're in the air. So I don't know, whatever. So I think that's basically it, guys. I, I don't know if I'm going to do anything else at this point. Uh, Freeze Easy Peak will be next. And, uh, yeah, that's a video. Uh, I'm going to save it. Save and quit. And, uh, yeah, I'm sure I'll see you all guys next time. Thanks for watching. Uh, love you. Bye.